Welcome back, my name is Josh from JFR Film. Now it's been quite a long time since I've posted a YouTube video, simply because uh, I've been super slow at editing them. So this was actually filmed about three months ago. Loading up this Minolta XD7 is Kez, my girlfriend. So we found this camera in uh, a barn. Um, it was actually her dad's, but hadn't been used since he started shooting digital. So the camera was given to me and I spent some time cleaning it up. It needed a new lens because the glass had been damaged quite badly by fungus. And of course it needed new light seals, new batteries, everything. But once it was up and going, we shot a couple of test rolls and now I've given her this roll of Kodak Ultramax and she's gonna have a go at shooting it herself. This is actually a really nice camera and one that I think gets overlooked quite a lot. So it was known as the XD7 or the XD11 in North America or just the XD in Japan and it was manufactured by Minolta between 1977 and 1984. So this was the top of the line Minolta when it came out. But interestingly, it was actually the world's first camera with aperture priority and shutter priority, as well as fully metered manual mode, making it a really versatile camera to use. It came out just before the Minolta X700, which I think is another fantastic camera. But this one was actually the last metal bodied SLR before the company switched to using plastic, which I think gives it a real premium feel. shooting directly into the sunlight. Again, belonged to her parents that we found in this barn. 
but she doesn't typically shoot a whole lot, um, especially with an SLR.